You know, when you first get your drone, you're thinking, like, man, where can I go to get some footage? Do I want to go to the beach, the park, the mountains? Do I just want to fly in my neighborhood, the river, the lake? Wherever it is you go, you find out that it's a hassle real fast. You're taking your old case and you get a remote, you have extra batteries, you have chargers, you have blades, you have blade guards. Stuff is sliding around in the back of your car, it's in your trunk, it's in multiple bags. It's just a mess. Just get yourself one case that holds everything. That's one of the features that I like about this. It's the peace of mind. I know everything is gonna be in here. So what I did, I went and bought me a case. And I'm gonna show you the benefits of having one and why I like this particular one. For your convenience, I left a link in the description below in case you wanna get this drone case. It takes you directly to Amazon where you can view some more pictures and you can get a little bit more detailed description on the size and the material that the case is made out of. Right here is the original case that the DJI Spark came in. We're all familiar with this case. As you open it, another feature, look how snug that is. Okay, the Spark fits in here fine. And you have one battery and if I had another battery it would go right here and then here's two spots for my blades. Now, if that's all I have, it does work. No, no handle or no strap, but it does work. But as you see, you can quickly outgrow this little small case. I have a remote, I have the charger, I have cables. There's just no room for that. You have two large zippers that open all the way around so that the case opens completely up. Before I open the case, Look at this strap handle right here. I mean the strap hook. You see this hook? Very heavy duty. Feels as if it'll never break so you don't have to worry about ever dropping the case. As you open up the drone case, you can see it has two different parts. Right here at the top back, this is a mesh compartment, zipper mesh compartment, and this can store, you know, if you have an extra cell phone, or your tablet. For me, right now, I have my car charger, which I love this thing, by the way. I have my car charger and I have some filters. I have some filters for the drone. So that sits right here, nice and tucked away in the back. Then, this little pouch, I mean, not this pouch, this protective, uh, it's a protective cushion between the drone and the mesh. You have these six little mesh slots for accessories. Right here, I have some blades. I have three blades and I have an extra OTG cape, OTG cable. And then this is padded so it keeps the drone nice and safe. My drone sits in its designated spot, which this material right here, it feels as if it's a padded cardboard but it holds the drone pretty stiff which I like that so the drone fits into its little compartment and then you have one two three spots for three extra batteries and then a battery that could be in the drone so you can have four batteries with this thing as you see the remote it fits down and then I have two two more slots I could have my charger right here but I'm using this is the cable this is the USB cable that comes with the charger and then another OTG cable. So as I close it, you can see everything is nicely protected. As I'm shaking it, nothing seems to move around. The case is very thin. I like that because it easily fits into bags and backpacks, which I'll show you that in a second. The first backpack that I'm going to show, this is just my normal day-to-day -day backpack. If you want to go to the park or the beach or something, bring your laptop. It's that size of a backpack. Here's the case. Fits in here. No problem. Backpack zips up. Backpack zips up. and So it fits in your backpack. Take your backpack with you. The second case, the second backpack that it fits in, obviously, if it's in the small one, it's going to fit in my bigger 
a bigger backpack. This is a, what's the size? This is a 55L type hiking backpack. Obviously, it fits in here. So that's both of my backpacks that I can sit here and put my drone case in and I know everything is gonna be in here safe, secure, and with me. Just to give you an idea how the case looks when you're carrying it, right now I have it over my shoulder, or sorry, across my body, and it hangs down pretty far. Obviously, you can put it on just one side, carry it with the handle, or just carry it. So it's a very versatile case. In a pinch, the case can be used as a landing and launching pad also. After I got the DJI Spark case, I realized it was made from some special eco-friendly materials that made the case not have that plastic smell. So it really doesn't smell bad, and I, which that's important to me because I'm allergic to a lot of things. And the fact that this doesn't smell, uh, it gets a thumbs up for me. Now, right now, the case doesn't have anything on the back. This is how it comes. All you have, all you have is the lettering right here. But, since this is my case, I'm about to put my name, Oxman again on it, DJI Spark, and a nice ox on the back. Man again, DJI Spark. That cool looking logo right there. Yeah, that's cool. Now, I just showed you the reasons why you should get one, the one I have, and how I use it. As usual, I appreciate your time. If you have any questions, feel free to hit me up. Be sure to get back at you guys. You guys have a good one. Thanks for watching.